Hi, it's Bill Myers, and this is my video tip of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to quickly add a chroma key effect in Sony Vegas Movie Studio. What you see in here is Movie Studio, and I've compressed the screen so it'll fit in the, the screencast. And these are the, the video and audio tracks here. There's actually several tracks, but I'm only showing five of them so that they'll fit on the screen. And what I've got down here is my media that I've loaded for this project. And what I've done is I've used File, Import, to import the media for my project. And the media I have is I have a video clip of me in front of a green screen, and I have a just a JPEG image of some ferns, and then a motion back which I'm going to put behind me. So to do this, I'm just going to drag the video clip up onto the track. And there's the video clip, there's the audio clip. Notice that now that the clip's up there, the preview window shows me with a green screen behind me. The next thing to do is to, to drag a backdrop up. And there's my backdrop. I'll just drag it all the way across and you can see that it's not behind me there even though I've got it on the clip. That's because I haven't yet uh, applied the chroma key effect. To do that, I go down here to video effects and you see I have lots of video effects to choose from. But I'm going to choose the chroma key which is right there. And then on the chroma key I have several presets and one of them happens to be green screen. I'm just going to drag green screen right up here. When I do notice that in the preview I have the green screen behind me and I also have a control here where I can adjust the different elements so I can adjust the the low threshold and the high threshold to change the green screen effect to give me a better uh, match and if I choose to I could just use the eyedropper to get a perfect match but I'm going to go with that as you can see from the preview now and I'm going to slide the preview over that there is a green screen the um, backdrop here is behind me and the motion backs, let's see if I put the motion backs up there. Let's put a motion back up there by going back to my project media. I'll grab the motion back and put it right there. You'll see this behind me if I hit play. What I've got set up in this room, let me uh, zoom out. And you can see that the green screen is behind me. It, I'll bring it back over here where you can see a different area. You can see the green screen is behind me there. Anyway, this is uh, Sony Vegas Movie Studio. It's really easy to apply a green screen effect. I'm Bill Myers. This is my video tip of the week. To find more like this, go to www.bmyers.com.